Hello, I'm Dhanya Rajendran from the News Minute and I'll be quickly looking at two news stories from South India. On Sunday afternoon, as people from Bengaluru's BTM layout and Hulimau area were relaxing in their homes, suddenly water entered their houses, inundated their streets and caused massive damage. A private contractor was doing some work on the Hulimau Lake Bund. He was in fact trying to make water from the lake flow into the stormwater drain. But in the process, damaged the Bund, thereby flooding all the streets around it. This really raises two important concerns. One, what is the scientific assessment that agencies like the BBMP, which may have hired the contractor and contractors themselves do while working on water bodies? The second and the most important concern is that there is absolutely no place for water to flow into even if there are heavy rains or that bund had been breached naturally. The fact remains that flood plains have been encroached on, there has been rampant construction and urbanization in the last few years and Bengaluru and other cities need to talk about it more. The second story is a political one from Tamil Nadu where RSS ideologue S. Gurumurthy in a speech said that he had an important role to play in O. Pranir Selvam's Dharma Yuddham against Shashikala. According to S. Gurumurthy, in 2007, OPS came to him with concerns on how to stop Shashikala's uh, swearing in ceremony and Gurumurthy said, are you not a man, do something. Now, why is this important now? If OPS does not uh, deny these comments made by Gurumurthy, then it actually proves that the RSS and therefore the BJP had a role to play in this entire rebellion in the AIA-DMK. Now these comments made by Gurumurthy can be used uh, against OPS not only by his opposition but by people within his own party too where there is a clear struggle for one leader to emerge, the struggle between Edapadipalani Swami and Opani Selvam. Thank you.